Meanwhile, over hundreds of Wangaras participated in the enskinment of a new Wangara chief at Nungwa in Accra. The new chief is expected to champion the well-being of Wangarans at Nungwa. The Wangara people trace their origin to the old Ghana and Mali Empire. After the collapse of these two great empires, the majority of the Wangaras fled to settle in different parts of the country, with Kentampo serving as their ancestral home. Today, the Wangara community is pursuing an agenda to explore ways that can help harness the potentials of Wangaras in national development. One of such ways is the setting up of traditional establishment which will encourage and promote the well-being of Wangaris in their various locations. At a ceremony in Nungwa, a suburb of Accra, to enskin a Wangara chief, sons and daughters of the Wangara community came in their numbers to support one of their own. The main ceremony started with the preparation of dishes accompanied with some indigenous Wangara performances. Next was the enskinment process. The trustee, Alhaji Dr. Musa Usman Udumbia, is a senior lecturer at the Accra Technical University. The Council of Elders prayed for him for a successful reign. The newly enskinned chief, Alhaji Dr. Musa Usman Udumbia, spoke to GTV Life News. I would want to um, quote one famous philosopher, uh, King and the Emperor Marcus Aurelius, who said he would want one day his people to remember him as the king who gave back Rome. Uh, it's through identity, you know. Uh, I would want to be remembered as the chief who positioned Wangares, okay, in national development, you know, brought them to the fore or make sure our contribution as a community is felt in national uh, issues. The national organizer of the Bekandi Wangara Association, who is also the Wangara chief of Pando in the Volta region, shared some thoughts with GTV Live. Today's event is a very memorable day. Uh, Teshi happened to be uh, an old community where uh, Muslims and, uh, to be precise, the Wangaras settled. Uh, we have the root of Wangaras settling here. And so today, if we have a new chief who is a doctor, uh, you, can, you can not describe it as anything but uh, a memorable uh, day. On his part, the public relations officer of the National Council of Zango Chiefs, Chief Imoru Babaisa, said the contributions of Wangaris cannot be underestimated and hence efforts are underway to preserve the identity of Wangaris. We are also fighting the establishment of homeland, you know, where you can reach out the Wangaris wherever they are. And then, of course, having a language as part of the system must also be considered. The president of the Greater Accra Council of Wangara Chiefs, Chief Alhaji Siddiq, re-echoed the need for Wangaras to unite among themselves. The Wangara people are one of the peaceful ethnic groups in Ghana with a rich culture.